All right, hi guys. All right, we're gonna put together our scarecrow. As you can see, I started putting him together, but we forgot to push the play button on the camera, so we were gonna see a little bit of glue already on there. Whoops. All right, anyway, so we have our bag and all of our pieces for our scarecrow. Remember we made the puppets for the farm animals? Well, we're gonna do the same thing, but it's gonna be a scarecrow. So make sure the little flap is this way so that you can make your scarecrow talk. All right, and then you're gonna cut out your hat. I was describing before that make sure your thumb is up and you're using your helper hands to cut around the hat. And you're using your helper hand to help you turn the paper. So that way your right hand, if you're right-handed, you're gonna stay on the right side of the paper. And if you're left-handed, then you're gonna stay on the left side of the paper and turn it as you cut. All right, now we're gonna put on the scarecrow's head. I put a little bit of glue already, but I'm just gonna put a little bit more so our scarecrow can stick onto the flap, our circular head. And we're gonna put a little bit of glue here. Again, if there's some color that you're seeing, it'll dry clear, so don't worry about all that purple mess there. Okay, and then we're gonna put on his triangle nose. Whoops, it has one, two, three. It's a triangle. It has three sides and one, two, three points. And we're gonna use that for his nose. So let's put on his triangle nose. And then we're gonna give him his hat. So let's just put a little line up at the top like that and put on his hat. And don't forget his straw hair. Scarecrows, when they're on the farm, they, actually, let me take the hat off for a minute and put the hair on first. They are made out of the straw or the hay that the horses eat. So that's what we, we gave you, something that looks a lot like hay. And do you know who else likes to eat hay? Yes, it's Snowball. Snowball likes to eat hay. All right, so here's our scarecrow. And I'm actually gonna use some of our Elmer's. If you have Elmer's glue at home, that might be better to making our hay stick on the hair, the hair for the hair scarecrow. <laughs> All right, so let me just use, and also for the hat, to put it on top of the hay, it's kind of hard. So maybe use a little Elmer's glue. If you don't have Elmer's, this should be fine, just you have to let it sit for a while to dry. All right, and there we have it. We have our scarecrow. I'm gonna let him sit for a bit, and that's why I have you doing that in the beginning of the week so he can dry for our Wednesday's Google Meet. All right, have a good day. Bye.